What's up everybody? It's your boy DK. I uh, wanted to make a part two of that video that I showed y'all yesterday, actually last night. Um, so of these spikes, they're six inch uh, billet spikes and everything like that. So I uh, want to go ahead and show them to you and uh, let me know what you think. Don't mind my bugs and everything like that. It is dirty. But one thing I tell you, this truck is not no trailer queen. This thing will hit a four and five hour trip. You know what I mean? And in, in no time, it don't matter. I drive this truck everywhere and I still haul with it. You see the name in the wheels. It's painted down in there too. But these is uh, six inch billet spikes. They're all thread on, everything like that. I need to wash my truck. But anyway, in between here and the rim, there is an O-ring. It keeps the, the water and everything like that from getting down off inside of there. A lot of times, water seeps down in between here, and when you start to spin, it leaves a rust trail going down your wheel like that. So with that O-ring being in there, you don't have to worry about that. Um, these are very solid. They're thread on, everything like that. So you don't have to worry about these coming off, anything of that nature. So... Uh, definitely a quality product that's for sure man these things look so good this wheel's a lot cleaner over here I did wipe it down just a little bit. These right here just look so much more gangster than, than what I had up on here. I'll show you something. These are the ones that came off of here. If you look real close, they got wrinkles and stuff like that. It's almost as if, uh, you know, they got hot or something at one point or, you know, I'm, I don't know. I'm not for sure. The manufacturers say that they don't know. I'm sure that this isn't the first case that this has happened, but you know, I don't have step when it comes to my truck, so I'm not going to have step when it comes to that as well. Um, I am registered for the Dub Car Show in Chicago next week. Uh, not next week, but next month. Um, I can't roll up to a show with stuff like that. Um, I don't do low quality, anything like that. So, you know, I need something that's going to stand up to what I'm throwing at it. So, um, you know, a lot of people ask me, where do I get these spikes? I got them from Roll On Customs. So uh, shout out to Roll On Customs. They did an awesome job, super fast shipping. Uh, I couldn't have been any more happier. So if you get a chance, go up over to their page. I know that they're on Facebook, like their page, share their page. Um, you know, if you happen to have any questions, feel free to either hit me up, hit them up. Um, I did pay $34 a piece, um, 40 spikes, everything like that. Um, so it was $1,400 by the time it actually made it to my door and everything like that. Uh, a lot of people ask me, well, why do you pay so much, you know, for spikes? Well, for that simple reason. I can't roll up the car shows with stuff wrinkling, you know, up on my wheels and everything like that. You know, like I said, I don't have step. You know, you got to pay for quality, longevity, you know, stuff like that. So, um, you know, like I said, I'm just not going to roll like that. So you got to pay the cost to be the boss. And uh, that's where I'm at with it. So... Other than that, um, that's really about it. Um, I just wanted to go ahead and share that. So again, you know, shout out to Roll On Customs. You did an awesome job. Um, if you get a chance, like my page, share my page, like my posts, share them, everything like that. I'm also on YouTube up under DK Custom Dually Wheels. Uh, if you get a chance, go over there, subscribe, like it, share it as well. Um, everything like that. I'm gonna keep trying to go ahead and bring you these videos. 
uh, stuff like that, footage from different car shows, stuff like that. So I ain't going nowhere no time soon. So with that being said, you know, this your boy DK signing off.